Good evening, this is Sonny from Jax. It is December 7th, the uh, opening day of Ultimate Masters. Ultimate Masters went on sale today. Uh, today we're gonna open on this box and we're gonna map it out for you guys. With me, I have uh, Felicia and we have Ben. Both of them are uh, already qualified for regionals. They uh, won their own prospective PPTQs. Uh, so uh, this is part of uh, the aspiring team, Jax. We're gonna open this box up and talk about some cards in it. But uh, you know, only the best with the best, right? All right, here goes, guys. We're gonna go and um, check it out. Now we're gonna open the uh, the box topper last, not first, but last. So that's gotta, what I'm excited. You for. gotta bear with us. Um, we're gonna put it right here in front. And then we're going to map out this box a little bit, see how it does. All right, so first thing we do is the first pack on the left, number one pack on the left. Go ahead, Ben, see what you're going to do. Then we're going to do that flippy thing, and then she'll, uh, she'll zoom in on us when we should use to. Technical difficulties. It's okay. If it's your pack, it's probably already been open. My ah. packs are stronger. Yeah. <laughs> Thing I'll it for you. First off, we got an Undying Rage, followed by a Martyr of Sands. Mm. That's a card that's playable in Modern. Mm. Uh, that's good. Tom Ross was just talking about Ma Martyr Proc mm. being mm. good again. We got an Arc Rune Crusader. Mm. Death Denied. Mm. Got some Patchwork Gnomes. Patchwork Guys. Mm. I'll buy a Shred Weakness. Yeah. Olivia's Dragoon. Mm. I remember that card fondly. Got Stitcher's Apprentice. And a Reckless Worm. Reckless Worm. Madness. Used to be uncommon. <laughs> Gotta think twice. Alright. And a Forbidden Alchemy. That's uncommon. Yep. We got a Wild Hunger. Yeah. Dawn Charm. On charm. Your rare. Oh, and a demonic, demonic two. Here. Ooh, demonic two. How much you think it's gonna be, Felicia? Uh, I think it's at least a. Wasn't it like thirty to forty last? A solid card. Yeah. Solid staple in uh, Commander, Legacy. What's your foil gonna be? Foil's gonna be Spirit Karen. Oh, that's good. That's good. All right. Pack one, left side. Uh, our rare was a demonic tutor. Our foil was an uncommon Spirit Charm. All right, we're going with pack two on the left side. Here you go, Felicia. Let's see what we got. There. All right, corn boy. All right, let's see. So first off, we have angelic renewal, followed by double cleave. Solid. Followed by soul's fire. Yeah. Get a Johnny card. <laughs> followed by a uh, Ronum unicorn. Eel umbra. Not Totem one of the armor. super popular uh, Totem armors, but Boggles Umbras, but still a Totem Armor. And, uh, awful Snout. Awful Snout, yeah. yeah okay. Awful. Mm -hmm. Kodama's, Kodama's Reach. It's a staple. Find you some lands. It's definitely a staple. Canker Abomination. Mm -hmm. Flight of Fancy. Mm -hmm. Hyena Umbra, which is Much used in, uh, in the Boggles deck in Modern. Here uncommon. on Uncommon, we got right. Angel of Despair. Used to be a rare. Now it's an Uncommon. We've got Snake, Snake Umbra. Umbra. We've got Miss Vale Plains. Mm -hmm. Here's your rare. Here's our rare. We have uh, Spoils, Spoils of, of the, the Vault. Vault. What do you think it's going to be? About $2, 3 dollars. Yeah, probably. Okay. <laughs> Let's foil. see what our foil is. Uh, raid Bombardment. A uh, much better looking card. All right, so pack number two, left side. We have a regular Spoils of the Vault and a common... Foil Raid Bombardment. Alright, let's go with pack three. Pack three left side. Now, uh, since uh, I don't read good upside down, we're going to have uh, <laughs> Felicia or Ben read the card out. Right. I don't read too good anyway, but definitely not upside down. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we're going with. First card. First card we've got uh, nice Dan Cryer. Yep. Shielding, Shielding Plaques. plaques. 
Raid Bombardment, Bombardment. Golgari Brown Scale, Fumes Bitter, mm. Moan of the Unhallowed, mm -hmm. Staunch Hearted Warrior, Just the Wind, Seder Wayfinder, mm -hmm. Frantic Search, All right, Uncommon Time, uh, Garner the Blood Flame, All right, Legendary Uncommon. We got a uh, swift reckoning. All right, last uncommon is gonna be a uh, furnace celebration. All right here comes our rare. All right, Stirring Wildwood. Wildwood. Playable, very nice playable. Yes. What you think nice. it's gonna be? Uh, I reckon it's a little bit cheaper than uh, than raging ravine, so probably less than ten. About eight dollars. Yeah. Eight to ten. Okay, our foil is gonna be. Slippery boggle. Slippery boggle. A lot of boggle stuff. Boy. Yeah, uh, it's a good looking card though. And it's full. It's yeah, a big old fly looking dude. New art. Mm -hmm. So, third pack left side is a rare Storing Wildwood and an uncommon Slippery Boggle Foil. Alright, number four on the left side is Ben's turn. Come on, Liliana. This is definitely going to be a new case, so anything could happen. Alright, let's see what we got today. Alright, starting off, we have a. Wandering Champion in a Repel the Darkness. Got a Spark Spitter. Prey Upon. Nice little fight spell. Mark of the Vampire. Got a Wickerboro Elder. And a Dark Dabbling. A Hissing Iguana. Hissing Iguana. It's good and foil though. And we got a rune snag. Always playable. Cathodian. Mm. Makes that mana for you. Got to rally the peasants. Now we're going to have a hero of Lenia Tower. And we got a Shriek Maw. Shriek nice Maw. evoke yeah, creature. Nice uncommon there. That's time for the rare. And we have an ancient, a ancient, ancient tomb. tomb. What do you think of ancient tomb? About 20 bucks. Solid 20 Give or take, yeah. yeah. Well, if you like that one, you might like this uh, foil rare. We gotta seize the day. Yeah, seize the foil day, rare. foil rare. Okay. So pack number and four. A merit and token. Merit oh, Merit Merit yeah. Lead. yeah. For that dark so, depth from the last box. So uh, fourth pack on the left side has a rare foil and a regular rare ancient tomb and seize the day. So this is probably a solid thirty forty dollar pack. All right. Felicia has pack number five on the left side. So five on the left side is coming up next. Let's see what we got. First off, we have uh, Faithless Luden. That's a yeah. modern staple. Pretty much every deck that plays red. We sell that a lot. We have uh, Ronum Unicorn okay. again. We've got Turn to Mist. All right. We've got Molten Birth. Mm. Makes some uh, elementals. Yes, it does. We've got Spider Umbra. Uh, Umbra time. We've got Last Gasp. Uh -huh. Good kill spell. Pulse of Marasa. We've got uh, Skywing Aven. Skywing uh, Hyena uh, Umbra. That's a good box for Boggles. Uh, Sultai Skull Keeper. We've got Sigil of the New Dawn. It's uncommon. No problem. We've got Ghoul Steed as a uncommon. Uh, that's old favorite. Horse. We have uh, Heap Doll, our Heap last doll. uncommon. Here comes the, the rare. Let's see. We have uh, uh, Talran Sky Summer. Uh, he's a about $7, $8. And our, our foil is uh, Archeomancer. Oh. Gets you some spells out of your graveyard. Oh. I think we minus that pack total, but it's okay. So the fifth pack on the left side is Talran and Sky Summoner and a common foil Arc uh, Archeomancer. All right, number six. So we're going to number six on the left side. Let's see how lucky we're going to get. Yeah, we're going to have a mythic yet, haven't we? Yeah, well, we're supposed to have four mythics a box. we got four mythic black box. So Here it is, right here. Let's <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Hopefully there's one in here somewhere. All right, let's talk about... Generator Servant. Conviction. Conviction. Safe Hold Elite. Nice health. Pro of Dark Titans. Red weakness, shed weakness, shed, shed weakness. weakness. Mm -hmm. Unholy hunger. Okay. 
uh, blood flow commissioner or connoisseur. Yeah. Uh, Expanse. 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 Always selling them guys. Aether, Aether snipe. snipe. Another nice mm -hmm. rogue creature. Fiery temper. temper. Always nice to discard. Right, I'm coming time. Living, Living lore. lore. All right. Then we have Brawn. Brawn. Mm. We have a majoring network. network. Our rare is going to be Dig, Dig Through, through time. time. That's uh, what, about $5, $6 card? I think that's mm -hmm. right. Yeah, the foil is going to be a safe hold elite. All right. It's a good looking foil. Doesn't book a whole lot. So number uh, six on the left side is going to have a regular Dig Through Time and a foil common safe hold elite. All right, we're going with seven on the left side. Okay, number seven. <laughs> All right, let's see how we go. So we're starting it off. We have a Recto Ooh. Shred Freak, Freak mm -hmm. <laughs> and an Undying Rage. Mm -hmm. And we got a uh, Sky Spear Cavalry. Cavalry. Yeah. A Beckon Apparition, make a nice little token for you. And hybrid colors. Mm -hmm. I had a cool colors, a compass. And a Waker of the Grove. We got a Mining Slime. A Scuzzback Marauders. Mm. Got a Stitch Drake, a little zombie bird. We got a Deranged Assistant. Got a Reviving Vapor. It's uncommon. Yeah. Ooh, one of my nice favorites. Young yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's a solid $5 Ooh, uncommon. That was a good one. Followed up by a Kitchen Fink. That's a good two uncommons in a row. Now we got a rare here. We got a Life from Life the Loom. Life from the Loom. That's solid. Jody Keith would because. like that one. It's probably a solid $12. Got a, uh, got a foil crushing canopy. It's good with a foil though. Uh, Lone Citizen too. Oh, this is a solid pack. Pack number um, seven on the left side. The biggest money is going to be, of course, your two uncommons here back to back. And then uh, Life Alone is a solid uh, mid range of air. So, let's go to the next pack then. All right, number eight on the left side will go to Felicia. Let's see how we do it. You must have something good in it. Yeah, it's, it's fighting you. Oh, I see how you're supposed to open them. There's a little tear yeah, on there. There's a little tear, yes. Yeah. I made it easier. These don't tell nobody. Ah, I wish I would have known that right away. There's no manuals. <laughs> All right, let's see. We got uh, Resurrection. All right. We've got Double Cleave again. Mm. Something double strike. We've got a Reckless Charge. All right. Mm -hmm. We've got a Wandering Champion. We've got a uh, grounds, Groundskeeper. Mm -hmm. We've got a Grave uh, Scrabber. Scrabbler. Scrabbler. <clears throat> foil. Yeah, Unfoil Foil. Unfoil Foil. <laughs> Wild Mongrel. It's a solid card back in the day. Mad Prophet. Mm -hmm. boy. Treasure Cruise. Oh, mm -hmm. Always need those guys. Uh, first uncommon hero of uh, Iroas. Yeah, Theros block. Uh, second uncommon Chainer's Edict. Oh, that's old. School. That's Tempest block. And uh, Fecundity is the last uncommon. Uh, is that Mercadian Mass block? Yeah, if you're playing uh, that Goblin Storm deck, that's mm -hmm. an integral part of it. Uh, the rare here is uh, All is Dust. All is Dust. Um, that's pretty solid. That's, that's pretty solid. Range. Our foil mm -hmm. is uh, Unholy Hunger. All right, so. Number eight on the uh, left side is going to be a All Is Dust regular rare and a common Unholy Hunger. Still looking for those mythics. Mm -hmm. No mythics yet. This is number uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, number one in the middle. Number one in the middle row. That's what we're looking for now. All right, let's look at this here. Gilead's Pilgrim. All right. Vessel of Endless Rest. Nightbird's Clutches. Sl uh, Slum Reaper. Another Crushing Canopy. Eel Umbro. Gurmag Angler. He's a nice big guy. Uh, Whirlwind Adept. Face Fetters. Yeah, solid uh, solid. removal. Gain four life. Archimancer. Uncommon Time. Anger. Anger. Pretty man. Oh, I made it. Uh, common. Golgari Thug. 
Thuggin. Miraculous recovery. Yep. Here comes a rare. It is a KS the Unhollow. Mythic. So the first mythic is probably a solid seven eight dollars. The foil is gonna be a heap doll. Heap doll. So we have an uncommon foil and a mythic as the number one pack in the middle row. Number one pack middle row. Alright, number two pack middle row goes to Ben. Oh, that is a nice drink. Yeah, nice little zip right. Alright. It's weird that the. Turn it over. Okay. Turn it over, don't. <laughs> Sorry. Don't spoil it. Now. Look. Look. Alright, we got an ingot chewer, followed by an angelic renewal, hmm. got a mirror servitor, and a thermo alchemist. Get some mm. damage in there. We got a Verdant Eidolon. Alright. Cool. And we got this guy, a Sanitarium Skeleton. And we got Death Denied. With some ho Hooting Mandrels. Frantic Search. Got a Canker Abomination. We got Rogue's Passage, a nice Commander First card. Time. Slip, in, slip in for damage. Got a Circular Logic. That's a good uncommon. And we got a nice Ooh, lava, lava spike, spike here. Yeah, That's lava a spike. Personal favorite of mine. That's a good looking picture. New sure art. Sure is. All right, we got a rare coming up. That's a nice back to basics. Good legacy really staple. Really up some yeah, That's a couple dollars. What do you think? Yep. And we got this uh, foil molten birth. All right. All right. And an elemental token to go with. So it. pack <laughs> number two on the middle. Pack number two in the middle is a common molten birth foil and a back to basics. All right, we're going for number three in the middle. All right. All right. All right. First up, we have Martyr of Sand. All right, Martyr. Gain a lot of life in modern using that. We got a Spark Spitter. We've got a uh, Acacian Crier. We've got Turn to Mist. We've got a Fume Spitter. Next up, we got a Basking Root Wallow. Gurmag Angler, Big Delve Boy. Uh, we've got a Wingsteed Rider up next. Think Twice. Hissing Iguana. Hissing. <laughs> Swift Reckoning, uncommon. first uncommon. Urban so, Evolution, second urban uncommon. Evolution. Last uncommon is Murderous Red Cap. I remember nice that guy. guy. All right, our rare card here is uh, Containment Priest. Containment Priest. Eight dollars. Uh, foil, yeah. Our foil is uh, Foil Gurmag Angler. Oh, oh man, I'm a lot of Death Shadow and. All right, so uh, number three, number three in the middle, is a rare uh, Containment Priest and a common Foil uh, Gurmag Angler. Number three in the middle. All right, we're going to move on to number four in the middle. Do I need some to drink? Oh, no, I'm good. All good? All good here. Okay. See them? All excited right. for the cord. All right, again, we're going four in the middle. Here we go. Soul Sire. God's, God's willing. willing. Arena athlete. athlete. Arena athlete. Defy Gravity. Just like that. Twins of Mara State. Padama's Reach. Always a land. good staple. I need more of those. Patchwork, Patchwork Noon. Mm -hmm. Just the Wind. Cthodian. Cthodian. Flight of Fancy. The number Worm. That's the first uncommon. Copy of them. Yep. All right. Sec Buried, Buried alive. alive. That's a nice staple for Black. Any format. Slide of hand. hand. Oh, here Using comes storm and modern. Here comes the rare flagstone. How much do yeah. you think it is? That one I'm not sure. On About five dollars, six dollars, give or take. Our foil is going to be a Olivia's dragoon. Olivia's dragoon. So Vampire. number four in the middle, we have a common foil, Olivia's dragoon, and a rare flagstones of Tracker. All right, number five in the middle goes back to Ben. Find that 
So starting off, we have Ulamog's Crusher. He's got some new art there. Let's see that. Eldrazi. Got another Molten Rain. Molten Birth. Molten Birth, excuse me, not quite Molten Rain. <laughs> we got a Sky Spear Cavalry. Mm. Beck and Apparition, gets mm. you a Spirit Token. Got an Awful Snout. And another Olivia's Dragoon. We got a Staunch Hearted Warrior. Mm -hmm. Got a Fire and Ice, looks like our first split card. Skywing Avon. A Seder Wayfinder. First Uncommon, Arise from the Tides. Followed by a Blast of Genius. And we got a... Songs of the Damned. Songs, Songs of the, of the Damned. Damned. All right, here comes that rare. We got a... Pattern of Rebirth. Pattern of Rebirth. rebirth. Got Solid. that Therese Nielsen Gorgeous art on Gorgeous Therese Nielsen artwork. Yeah. And followed by another Foil Eldrazi. It's an artisan of Kozilek. Reanimate okay. you some stuff. Foil and Common. All right, Excited. so number five in the middle ends up being... A foil uncommon, artisan of Kozilek, and a pattern rebirth. Solid, what do you think? Fifteen dollar card. Green. All right, you have the Liliana pack. That's going to be number um, six in the middle. Six in the middle is a picture of Liliana. What other picture would you want, really? Well, that's always we get. It's always the unspoken rule. You see that picture of the planeswalker? It's got to be there, right? The Amazon, bro. <laughs> Mammoth. Oh, we got the big umbra. A Crokin a Crowan Crusader. Mm hmm We've got a uh Tecmos High Priest. Alright. Mark priest. of the Vampire. I got a four one of those. Uh Wickerbow Elder. Wickerbow. Dark Dablins. Mm. Shed Weakness. Archeomancer. Mm. We've got a Reckless Worm. Reckless Worm. Got a Stitcher's Apprentice. Turn with the uncommons here. We got Unburial Rites. Classic um, reanimator. Yeah. Right got a Brazen Scourge. Good old Kaladesh Gremlins. Haste 3 3. Uh, got a oh Eternal Witness. Uncommon. Oh, New I always, I always need thing. those guys. It's nice. Rare is going to be uh, Magus of the Bazaar. Magus of the Bazaar. Our Thank foil you. is going to be Shed Weakness. Shed Weakness. We got common in on the foil version. So, number six in the middle is a common foil, uh, shed weakness, and a regular rare Magnus of the Bazaar. And a pretty good eternal witness. Yeah. All right, so we're going to number seven in the middle. Seven in the middle. Here we go. All right, we got Resurrection, Demir Guild, Guild Mage, Mage, Raid Bombardment. Repel the Darkness, Moan of the Unhallowed, Pulse of Marasa, Golgari Brown Scale, Got Fiery Temper, Fiery Temper. Nice playable card. Uh, what is that? Soul Tie Skull Keeper. Soul Tie. We got Hyena mm -hmm. Umbra. In common time. We got uh, Spirit mm -hmm. Corn. Spirit. We've got Prismatic Lens. Prismatic Lens. Add some mana. We got Counter yeah, Squall. Counter Squall. Wasn't that rare before or was that uncommon before? It was a rare before, wasn't it? It might have been. So. I'm pretty sure it was rare. Pretty good counter, though. Here's a rare. We had a mate. All right, so. Big boys. The foil is going to be Reckless, Reckless Worm. Worm. All right, so number seven in the middle is a common Reckless Worm and a rare Reanimate. Which brings us to number eight in the middle. All right, another Liliana pack. Started off with a conviction. Mm -hmm. conviction. Got a vessel of endless rest. Another faithless looting. Get to dig faithless up them cards. Very good yeah. card. Got a groundskeeper. Mm -hmm. Got a blood flow connoisseur. Nice sacrifice outlet. Got an unholy hunger. Got a miming slime. Not too many of them pulled. Another treasure cruise. Draw some right. cards. I need many of those. Got a Scuzzback Marauders. Got an Aether Snipe. Got a Conflagrate. Conflagrate. It's a nice, it's going in the dredge right yep. now, yep. 
Got a Mystic Retrieval. And an Appetite for Brains. Mm. Let's see what the rare is. We have an Eldrazi Conscription. Right. Nice way to turn your little guy into a huge Eldrazi. All right. And your oh, foil is a Devoted, devoted Druid. Druid. Devoted Druid. Oh, that's got to be at least a 4 or $5. Yeah, foil. Encounters Company. A zombie. All right. So, uh, number eight in the middle is a uncommon Devoted Druid foil and a rare Eldrazi Conscription. So, what do you think? Is the Conscription worth $8? Give or take. Right the Devoted there. Druid foil should be about Druid. three, Very four. Nice. If not a little bit more, I'm not sure what the regular price on Devoted Druid is. But it should be. It's definitely a sought after card. Yep. People love that, especially oh. in four. Pack one. This All should right. be a Pack one. Should pack one on the right side. So that last third. Pack one on the right. All right. We've got a Lotus Eye Mystics. Lotus Eye. We've got a Crow and Crusader. Okay. We've got God's Willing. Mm. Theros up there. Uh, we've got Beckon Apparition. Hybrid Mana. Baskin Root Wallow. Madness Time. Death Denied. Mm hmm. Last Gasp. Nigga 3, Nigga 3. Crushing Canopy to deal with those pesky flyers. Yep. Mm -hmm. Seder Wayfinder. We've got a. Uh, Flight of Fancy. You know, the first uncommon is Golgari Charm. Got some nice options there. We've got uh, Become Immense. Good That's Infect nice Stable there. Infect Stable. Make a guy real huge. We've got uh, Artisan of Kozilek. Nice ring. 9 And our rare is going to be a Daybreak Coronet. That yeah. is a big uh, nice Boggle Stable. Mm -hmm. And then our foil is going to be Golgari Thug. All right, what do you think the uh, nice Daybreak Coronet is going to be booking for? That one I'm not sure. You're gonna have to tell me, Sonny. <laughs> I would say about eight to ten dollars. Daybreak Coronet. At one time, it's it, I think spiked around twelve, fifteen. Yeah, I thought it was a little bit higher. Well, you know, it's it's just, this is not the first printing, of course, but uh, well, you know, it's about eight to ten. This uh, Gagari Thug is probably probably a dollar, a dollar fifty for uncommon foil. But that's it. That is the number uh, number one, one for one. one. Number one for the right, right side. So here's number two for the right side is me again. Put the Liliana pack. Mm -hmm. All right. There's nothing better than pulling the Planeswalker on the pack. Now we'll see how it goes today. Mm -hmm. Here it goes. All, All right. right. We got Racto Shred, Shred Freak. Freak. Nice in. Molten Birth. Nice Italian Crier. Vacation Crier. Prey Upon. Prey Good upon. old fight spell. Blood Flow Connoisseur. Yeah. Hootin Mandro. Yeah. <laughs> Dark Dablin. Think, Think twice. Thirty. Sultai Skullkeeper. Uh, common time. Ooh, Ooh, Boneyard Worm. Alright. Resizable. Prismatic Lens. Last uncommon. Spider, uh, spider spawn. Thank you a bunch of tokens. I'm Here's the rare. Be. It is a Glen Eldra Archmage. Oh, it's about fairy. Eight, about eight bucks. The foil is going to be a Undying Rage. Undying Rage. So number two on the right side is a common foil, Undying Rage, and the rare, regular rare is a Glen Eldra Archmage. All right, number three on the right side goes back to Ben. Nice little enchantment you can return to your hand. You got a safe hold elite, a little elf blood persist. Got a soul's fire. Mammoth umbra. Got a spider umbra. Keeping them umbras rolling. We got a moan of the unhallowed. Staunch hearted warrior. Got faith fetters. Got a rune snag. Good card there. Got a reckless worm. Got a malevolent whispers and a plume veil. All right, last one coming coming up. We got ancestors chosen. The rare is the rare is a Malastrum pulse. Nice Malastrum pulse. Nice way to destroy right. a bunch of pesky th tokens. That's a solid card. And then we got a foil martyr of sands. Nice. All right, martyr of sands. 
Ferry Road. All right, so that would be number three on the right side. We have a common foil modern sand, and the regular rare is a Maelstrom Pulse. Number four on the right side. Let's see what we got here. Got my fingers crossed for a minute. Uh -huh. <laughs> We've got Angelic Renewal, Demir Guild Mage. Reckless Charge, Crow of Dark Tidings, got Golgari Brown Scale, Fume Spitter, Unholy Hunger, Aether Snipe, Fiery Temper, Skywing Aven, Iridescent Drake is the first uncommon. Phalanx Leader is the second uncommon. And Firewing Phoenix is the last uncommon. Used to be a rare. It's good looking card, though. Here's uh, Goria's Vengeance. Goria's Vengeance. That's the first reprinting. Huh? Oh, Full uh, rare oh, flagstone. Oh, we're rising That's back a good pack. up. So the fourth pack on the right side is a foil rare, flagstone after Kerr, and a regular rare, uh, Goria's Vengeance. So we're rising back up. Hopefully we'll we'll uh, get some other stuff out of here. These last four packs. This is gonna be number uh, five on the right side. So pack five on the right side. We've only pulled one mythic so far, right? That's it. Yeah. Ooh, it's kind of dry. <laughs> I need I need some more mythics. <laughs> these right, last pack packs. Right. <laughs> now, here we go. All right, we've got Arena Athlete, Tethmus High Priest, Vessel of Endless Rest. Thermo Alchemist. Wild Mongrel. Oh, I like that. Spool Keeper's Accomplice. Pulse of Marasa. Got a Mining Sign. Treasure Cruise. Always need more of those. Terramorphic Expanse. Definitely need more of those. Find stock. those basics. Yeah. Uncommon. Dakmore Salvage. Another Uncommon. The number one. All right. Third Uncommon is... Unstable, unstable mutation. mutation. Here goes the rare. Got oh, a got key. Got key. About twelve dollars. The foil is a spider umbra. Nice. Spider umbra. All right. So the fifth pack on the right side is a common foil and a regular rare got it tea. All right, man. I don't know. We gotta have a, a mythic per pack. We got three packs left. So this is pack number um, six. Get the double mythic. Pack number six on the right side. Yeah, come on. Regular mythic, foil mythic. Yeah, we need that now. Some. Come on. Alright, so starting off, we have a Nightbird's Clutches. Followed by a Resurrection, a Shielding Plex, Gurmag Angler, a Waker, Walker of the Grove. Winds of Mara State. We got a Defy Gravity. And a Deranged Assistant. We got a Scuzzback Marauders. We got a Stitch Drake. Travel Preparations. We got Shiri Shizzo's Caretaker. And we have a Desperate Ritual. Way to get some. Storm players like that. Now we have a rare, it's a Pyrexian Tower. Pyrexian Tower. Mm. Not a mythic. And then we got a Twins of Mara State foil and a homunculus. All right, it's going to be pack number uh, six on the right side. The regular common foil Twins of Mara State and a regular rare Phyrexian Tower. Which of these towers worth? I don't yeah, remember. Not a few bucks. Probably a couple bucks at least. All right, right two more packs left. This is number seven on the right side. Last Liana pack. Man, you get all of those out of packs almost. Yeah. The perks About time sitting she's in, in the one. middle. <laughs> yeah. All right, we've got Ulamog's Crusher. Good old 8 8 for 8. Annihilator mm -hmm. 2. Faithless Looting. Yep, more than more of those. God's Willing. Mm -hmm. Mere Servitor. 
We've got a Wickerboro Elder. We've got a Slump Reaper. We've got Verdon Eidolon. Prefer the Eidolon of the Great Rebel, but he's pretty good too. Foil. Archeomancer. Seen a lot of him. Get some spells back for me. Mad Prophet. Boar Umbra, the first uncommon. We've got uh, Meringue River Prowlers, our second uncommon. Hmm. Got a good old Slippery Boy, Slippery Bogle. And our rare is going to be Vexen Devil. Mm -hmm. nice couple our foil will be in uh, Terramorphic Expanse. That's a gorgeous oh, yeah. foil. Here's a nice card. Nice looking picture. So, number seven on the right is a common Terramorphic Expanse foil and a regular rare Vexen Devil. Alright, well, I don't know. I hope, you, hope, this, hope this box doesn't have just one mythic in it, man. But either way, here's the last it's pack. To open them. Number eight. Number eight on the right there side. Is. There it goes. Alright, let me do it backwards. Alright, here we go. Alright, Lotus Eye Mystics. Racto Shred Free. We've got Inga Chewer. Gilead's Pilgrim. Crushing Canopy. Got a Sanitarium Skeleton. Grave sca uh, Scrabbler. Another Fire and Ice. Whirlwind Adip. And a Winged Steed Rider. Uncommons are coming. Alright, Brazen Scourge. Prentice Necromancer. Fiend Hunter. Hunter. Nice All right, here comes the last rare. It is a ow, mythic. Platinum Imperium. Platinum Imperium. Well, at least we've got two mythics. Nice card the foil to use is going to be a rune, oh, rune snag. snag. So it's a playable foil. Two mythics. So we finally got the other other mythic out of the box. The last box had four. This only box had only two. But Platinum Imperium is at least $8. So we got a little bit back out of that box. Um, this mm -hmm. is the box topper. There's only one card in it. So what we're gonna have is um, I'm gonna have uh, Miss Felicia here open it, and then Ben will name the card. All right. Carefully. Carefully. It's all foil. Mm -hmm. Don't want to turn it that way. Open it all the way. That way it won't get dragged. All right. All right. There you go. And we have the Kitchen Finks. Beautiful artwork. Kitchen Finks. Definitely nice. Ooh, how much do you think Kitchen Finks foil is? Probably 60. In a box topper? Yeah. For a box topper, I mean, yeah. It's definitely a playable seven. card. I mean, um, have to go look that up real quick. In modern. What deck is it played in? Um, mostly uh, Counters Company, um, but pretty much any deck that can run white um, Looking and for wanted some a value. recursive threat and some value and in life gain. You'll gain your life uh, over the course of the game, and if you have a way to reanimate them, you might sneak in a few extra life. You think he's sellable? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. What mm -hmm. do you think the guess of the value is before I look it up? I think around 60. I'd You're spot about. on? All right, I think uh, most websites are fifty nine ninety nine right now. Yeah, nice. I so figured pretty close. about sixty. I think the lowest so, one I saw was. was we did recover a little bit of money economy. for the box topper. Right. It definitely wasn't a uh, box topper Liliana or anything, but it is uh, still stout at sixty dollars by itself.